Hi, and welcome to another Heart and Soul Amber Shop Review. Uh, today we got a very interesting uh, item that we want to review for you, and let's get right to it. Alright, so today we are viewing the JTS Jadston Premium Circuit Tester. We just got this in the mail. Um, been looking for one of these circuit testers for a long time and uh, this one has been getting some pretty good reviews and we just wanted to pick up one we did our research and we decided that this was the one that we're gonna buy so we're gonna take a look at this thing and uh, uh, find out what it's about okay uh, first of all looking at it from the outside it's in a very nice well constructed box that's one thing that we like about products when a product is in a nice packaging. Um, that kind of gives us an insight to what's going to be inside the package. So we love this packaging. It's a very simple box. I love the beautiful black uh, color. It's really amazing. Okay, so um, let's read something. Uh, what it says on the back here. One thing it says that um, it says that this device is computer safe. Uh, computer safe. What does that mean? That means that it won't damage any of the sensitive electronic components in your car or in your computer. So that's very important to know because you don't want to have a device that you put in and you touch your batteries and you short out something, you know, all of a sudden something else isn't working because the device messed up a fuse or messed up a component, some kind of component inside of that device. So this says that it's computer safe. Another thing it says is that it has a black back, a backlit LCD display for accurate readouts. Why is that important? Well, some of these circuit, uh, some of the lower end circuit testers, they generally just let you know whether there is a energy voltage going through the line. So you will test your, put your, um, your needle on a post there, and if it lights up, it'll tell you yes. That means that there's an energy going through there. And if it doesn't light up, um, it doesn't. But what's nice about this is that it has that LCD display. But what does that do? Not only does it light up to let you know that there's an electrical circuit going through there, but it also tells you the power of the circuit that's flowing through the wire. And that's important because you want to make sure that your wire is delivering the proper circuitry or the proper energy or voltage through that line so that you're making sure that your device or unit that it's supposed to be operating, that it's functioning right. And that's very important, functioning or right. And that's very important that it has the proper amount of energy that's going through. And so this allows you to get that information in a visual form. Okay? What type of devices can you use this with? Well, according to the back here, it says this is for use with cars, boats, trailers, vans, RVs, motorcycles, airplanes, and snowmobiles. I mean, that's a lot of vehicles that this thing is very good for. And I'm sure that there's some other uh, vehicles or motor, motor vehicles that fall into that circle of units. But that's a large range of devices that you can use this for. And this is important because um, let's say that uh, you did a DIY uh, project and you install something in your car, whether it's a stereo system or, or an alarm system or something like that. You want to make sure that the circuitry is working properly and getting the proper energy. And with this, you could be assured in a visual and a digital format that you're getting the right amount of energy going through those lines. Okay? And again, it warns you that there's a needle sharp stainless steel probe that allows for easy piercing of those wires. 
a lot of times when you want to test the voltage on the wire, you want to take that post or the probe and stick it into the wire uh, so that that metal can send it and can uh, pick up that energy and give you uh, give you an information on what type of energy is going through that line, through that wire. Uh, and um, that's another thing that this does. Okay, so. Um, on the back it says that it has a testing cable that's 140 inches long, so that's a pretty good amount of length. Um, it draws current from 3 to 20 volts, and at that rate, this device will work about uh, 17 milliampers, milliamp hours, okay, of time, um, and from 20 to 48 uh, volts. It would run about 10 milliamps of our, our time. Okay, um, so let's open this bad boy up. <laughs> I know I use that a lot. Let's open up this box and find out what's inside. Okay, so the first thing we have here is courtesy electrical tape. Again, when I talked about that probe that you would stick into wires to do a test, um, you're going to want to seal that little hole up so that no fluids or anything gets into that wire and messes up that wire. So uh, this black electrical tape is a nice little gift, you know, uh, a little extra thing that they give you. I wasn't expecting that. Okay, so here's the actual unit. Uh, you got, some, you got a little uh, instruction here on how to use how to use it. It's some simple operating instructions, I guess. Yeah. There it is. Okay. Not really. Uh, not really hard. It's not really uh, complicated to use this device. It's pretty simple. Um, warranty card so that you can register your device and I guess that allows you to make sure that if anything happens to the device that you are protected of the warranty so that's in there and this device wrapped in this plastic protection and it's curled down and I guess you can stretch that out yeah that's quite a bit so that you can really move around with that so that's pretty cool um, feeling the construction of it the wiring the casing Everything feels pretty strong. Um, I like that. It's not cheaply made, and um, I can tell you that. Um, I mean, you're gonna have to fill it for yourself. This is a video, so we don't have filler vision yet, but I'm sure that that's coming uh, down the line. But it really does feel like a real steady and substantial uh, construction of this device. And again, there's that LCD display here so you'll be able to see what type of voltage is coming through uh, when you do your test what type of voltage is coming through along with the fact that this device will light up uh, to let you know that there is a voltage coming through the line That's really basically it. It's not complicated at all. The last thing is uh, the clamp. So let's see. Okay, it seems like the clamp is protected here by the cover here. So okay, then you would press down on that clamp, and this is for you to. I'm pretty sure this is so that you would connect to. 
a ground somewhere, some kind of metal that uh, you would need to connect this to. Any kind of metal in the car, uh, a boat, a steel boat or something like that you, that you want to connect this to, um, to so that you can get a reading. Okay, and, uh, and I guess once you're done, well I don't have to guess once you're done, I guess you would just close that back up and it's protected. So that's pretty cool.